Hi, welcome to my latest video on getting started in affiliate marketing as a beginner. And in today's video, I just want to cover some three great free tools that I use to help me finally identify my niche and my keywords. The first free tool that I use is Google Trends, and this is a brilliant tool, and like I said, it's free. And what you do is type in your keyword. Let's suppose I type in, say, child OCD. And um, it would then come up with a coloured line to show me how popular that keyword and niche is and also whether there's constant demand, i.e. is it sort of showing a consistent demand all year? Is it on the decline? Is it on the increase? I mean, obviously you only want to go with one that has actually shown consistent interest or something that's on the up. You don't want anything on the decline. If it's declining, just leave that niche and try another one. All right, that's Google Trends. You can then compare keywords as well. So for example, I could put in anxiety in children and I could see then if that would come up in a different colour line. And again, I would look for all that criteria. Is it on the increase? Is it consistent? Is it declining? And is it more or less popular than the other keyword? And obviously, whichever one is the most consistent, that's the one you choose. You can actually search by countries as well, of how people are searching within the specific countries. So that's Google Trends. The next one I use then, which I love, is called answerthepublic.com. This isn't totally free because you can only do a few searches per day which are free and otherwise you've got to upgrade but then just keep it to a few searches a day and you'll be absolutely fine again you type in your keyword and then it will then bring up data based on what people have been searching on google and bing and it compiles into what they call a search cloud and it's absolutely brilliant they come out in like sort of wheels and it shows you lots and lots of different options of keywords and niches that you can go for and it also will give you ideas that you can use within the title of your content. So that's answerthepublic.com. And the final free tool that I use and I really recommend for affiliate marketers when they're getting started. Uh, and that is called Google Alerts. And with Google Alerts, if you type in a keyword, it will then send you any popular content that has been published what, with your keywords in. So for example, if I put typed in the affiliate marketing, I would get lots of different articles that have been published that day on affiliate marketing. This can be brilliant for lots of things, including it can be good content to post um, for information on your social media. So you haven't got to think of content one day. You can actually use that. You can just put the link to it. But it can also be great for identifying some long tail keywords you might not have thought of and how to sort of um, do your title. Obviously, don't direct copy it because that's not nice and it's not good practice you can model it and sort of use it within your own content all right so that's it for today's video on getting started in affiliate marketing as a beginner um hope you enjoyed if you did please let me know in the comments and if you've got any further questions just post your question in the comments below i also have a free facebook group which i'll pop a link to in the comments and um, where i share more tips and advice on getting started in affiliate marketing as a complete beginner and also, if you want to um, see future videos of mine, you just need to do two things. Just subscribe to my channel. And if you hit the bell, that will then notify you of any future videos I make within this uh, on this channel. All right, thanks ever so much for watching. See you on the next video. Bye for now.